Welcome back to my vlog. Uh, y'all, I haven't picked up the camera in a week. That's Tiffany in the background. Um, that is Tiffany in the background. I have not picked up the camera in a week. Um, hope you guys caught my last video with the cook with me when I made my homemade Salisbury steak. But I have been um preoccupied with work. Not much, but work. I just wanted to share with y'all uh some of the little things that I did. I'm kind of not liking it. I'm still playing around with things um, to try to get the house, you know, a little sprucey just for the in-between look. So, so far, I got this right here. Sorry with the little, that's the little dust from the, from me putting that stuff up. I didn't wipe it off. But anyways, I got these little, um, what they call these? Uh, pompous grass or something like that. I got the white ones for right here. And then I got like pink over here because I'm trying to do like like an in-between Valentine's Day and Easter type thing going on here. So I decided to do pink and white. But I'm not feeling it as much as I thought I would. Maybe I need to figure out something different. I don't know. But I like the pompous grass, but I just don't like the flow right now. So I'm trying to figure that out. I did white right here and I did pink right there. But they're, they were super tall, so I had to bend the, the uh, end of the leaves, the stems, to get them, you know, whatever. To get them uh, to fit into the thing, because they were tall as hell. And I think I like the white better, so I think I want to order more white and put all white. I'm not sure. Or maybe I just need to find another picture for the wall right there or something but i did see these easter decor stuff that i wanted to add over there so maybe that'll help give me you know help do something better and over here all i did was added my um i added some little greenery these are my new these are my new my um uh, my succulents that i already had i had them for about a year so i just put one here and then i put two there and then I added these two little faux green plants that we found at Home Goods. So I added those two there. So to give this room a little color and a little natural color. So pretty much that's all I did. So on this side of the house, it looks like, well, just more natural and green anyway. And on that side of the house, I'm trying to put a little more color and Eastery decor over there. So I don't know. It's, each room about to have a different flow but I want it to flow together because I know I had got some comments about um, us having mirrored tables and the wood TV stand little do people know you can contrast your furniture however you want to wooden furniture goes with glass furniture it doesn't always have to be mirrored on mirror that's the misconception that people have if y'all pull up pinterest y'all see the difference in the flow of how the stuff goes not only that furniture isn't cheap so nobody's gonna keep replacing furniture just like that because somebody feels that it doesn't go right or they don't like it and that's okay but you can't think that it's supposed to be changed overnight to fit how you want it to fit because that's not the case so anyways i the reason why i tried to, i just wanted to stay simple over here because i couldn't find nothing or figure out nothing that could actually go with blue furniture so i didn't want to put too much color over here and it takes away from the blue furniture that we have because we don't have blue is a neutral it's more like a blue gray but i can't find anything to um i don't know I just thought maybe the color would probably throw it off so I decided to just do natural neutral colors over here and I was looking for pillow covers because I figured if I could change the tan pillows the tan pillows actually go it piggybacks off the uh, the TV stand that we already had because we at first we had black tables and this but I was looking for some pillow covers I was on Etsy seeing if I could find some pillow covers to put over the tan pillows to help bring out the color a little bit and then i can put more color in here if i can uh find some nice color neutral type pillows for the tan ones just to switch it up and i found some but they only have one in stock and i need three so i couldn't do that 
and that's about it so i've been playing around with like home decor stuff trying to figure out how i wanted to do certain things and i'm not really satisfied but that's the art of trying to get your home together you gotta play with it in order to get the stuff together shut up and we need to work on the room we haven't really did much to our bedroom yet but our bedroom is kind of small she wants a bigger bed she wants a king size bed which i agree but king size bed won't fit in this room right now so babe no it won't we already she she already we already crowded out we already got two dressers or our own dresser with two people in this little bitty room and then our two puppies it won't fit it definitely won't fit but anyways that's just a transition but it's a slow process and it takes time because home decor is not cheap it is very expensive but that pompous grass i think i paid for came with five and five each color had five in there and it was like 70 dollars just for that and i thought they were small i didn't know they were gonna be that big but they that stuff's not cheap so and just for those little two plants that i showed y'all they were 25 dollars a piece that's 50 dollars right there so just imagine how expensive home decor can get. So I got what I got and I'm gonna slowly make it work until I can eventually, so I can eventually get it to how I want it. So it's just a little bit at a time. Did y'all see that? Y'all see the flying puppy? Y'all see flying Aya? Aya! Flying Aya! Hi Blazy Blaze! Hi Blaze! Hey baby. Hey baby. Hey, he trying to get my drink. He can't have my drink. I think he was an alcoholic in his former life. He's an alcoholic. Y'all, do I sound like I talk country to y'all? I don't talk country. I promise y'all I don't. She bit you? Yeah, she bit my wrist. <laughs> she is a biter. Oh, bless you. She was choking. Ow, bitch. Stop. Stop holding her. Put it down. No, that's good. That's she, why I'm she, she like, put me down. No, but y'all, we about to find something to watch on TV and she like, she want to go to the store, but I don't feel like it. I'm just being real. Just like sometimes she don't feel like going to the store. I go by myself. Are you waving yeah. bye? Yeah. <laughs> but anyways, y'all, we're going to go find something on TV. I just wanted to come check in on y'all. And say hello what's up i gotta take my hair down that's gonna be a task in itself and then i gotta do something to it i think i'm just might flat iron it and ain't gonna hold the flat iron but hey it is what it is so y'all i just woke up from a nap i was knocked the hell out sleeping so good right and i guess i was dreaming about a fire or something and i jumped up and ran out to the living room like something burning out here and I thought the living room was on fire and it was just a candle, but nothing was on fire. And she's sitting here cracking up. So <clears throat> she thought it was funny. So she's like, I gotta, I gotta pull this one up off the camera. She gonna pull up the footage and bust out laughing. Nothing was funny about that, y'all. Fire in here. I said something burning out here, but <coughs> it looked like something was burning out there. I didn't know. I didn't know I was sleeping good and something was on fire. And, but I was dreaming about a fire. And then I woke up and happened to see the living room illuminated. Hey, That's because of the candle. Can I say something? Cocaine is a hell of a drug. <laughs> <laughs> say no to drugs. Cocaine is a hell of a drug. I don't do drugs. <laughs> but y'all, that mess scared the living crap out of me. I am bugging. And I'm like, oh, no, I ain't. I'm tripping. <laughs> And I think that's what girl, you said. What? Girl. <laughs> no, I got on boxers, like little boxer shorts. But y'all, uh, I had to tell y'all that that shit was so funny. We about to go get some food, but oh, like, here. this is what's illuminating out here. It's just candles, illuminating, just candles, nothing serious, just some damn candles. But just imagine seeing that flash. Just out here while you in the dark in your room, sleep, taking a nap, and you see that. And I jumped up, and she's just looking like, what the hell is she jumping up for? Uh, <clears throat> I'm definitely putting these candles out. 
before we go. Even though JJ at home, I still not taking no chances. Still not taking no chances. I gotta go buy me a candle cutter. Maybe I'll go get one tomorrow. Or maybe I just bought it. So, before y'all ever leave the house, make sure y'all blow out y'all candles. Never leave y'all candles lit. Never. Even if y'all running up the street to the store, because it can quickly cause the fire. I got issues, huh? I got issues, huh? I thought it was a fire, okay? All right, well, we'll be right back. You know, we're about to get some. Papa as chicken, because we want some Papa as chicken. Oh, easier. You know you've been taking around about us. Why? I'm sorry, I could have shut up. It doesn't mean anything, I swear. Hey there. How's it going, sexy? I'll just go. Really, JJ? Okay. Really? What the hell was he doing? Y'all don't pay him no attention. Cause he, well, he know he cute, but he he be, he be extra. So y'all, we made it back, 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 back. We got a little smorgasbord going on over here. We got Popeye's chicken, checkers, or rally's fries, and red lobster biscuits. I know. Yeah, many probably like what happened to the diet. Well, my type of diet is you eat what you want, but you eat it in moderation. You heard? You heard. But yeah, the whole time there, I was in the car watching uh, like vlogs, like home decor videos to get some inspo and all that stuff. Cause I know when I, what I told you earlier, I'm just not feeling what's Ooh. going on. I like it, but I don't like it. I feel like I need to do something. I just need to figure it out what I need to do. But what in the Jesus pieces? Amazing. Okay. Big ass bag of marshmallows. Yes. And edible glitters. Cause she wanna make some chocolate balls. No, no, these are for me to eat. She, I'm saying she gonna eat these ones. Mm -hmm. Cause she just like the marshmallows. Like she pick all the marshmallows out of the Lucky Charm cereal. And then I bought her some of them uh, molds to make the little chocolate bomb things. She wants to make them. Even though Christmas over, she still want to make them. What that got to do with Christmas? Because they make them cocoa balls for Christmas. Yeah, bro. That's, that's all year She said it's going to be all year round thing for that's her. <laughs> Playing no games with that. But it's about to smash. And then I got to start taking my hair down. So, yeah. If y'all have any ideas or what I can do. I know one of the vloggers said do some green. I did green and I like it. I already had the green uh, little plants at home except for those two ones that I showed y'all earlier. So I try to stick with or try to use like shop my home for the little bit things I have which I don't have much. Um, Because as I told you home decor can be expensive. I see a lot of things in home goods and at home store that I liked, but I just couldn't see me dishing out all that money at one time. Like I saw a new picture that I wanted, but I'm gonna wait because the picture was like $150. So I was like, I might, I might as well wait instead of, uh, might as well, might as well, might as well, one of those. Uh, wait until, um, I really want to spend the money on it because I want to replace the picture that's behind us. I think I want, I want a more solid picture with like uh, maybe, I don't know. I saw one and I want to have to show it to y'all next time I go. But I might get it, but well, who knows. Well, I will get it, but when? I don't know. You're back in friends. Ooh, I got my hair taken down, y'all. Bad hair day. Yeah, I know, it looks like a hot mess. I I'm, I'm, I'm about to go wash it. Take a shower and wash it. But y'all see these? I uh kind of folded the stems down some so they wouldn't be so tall. Cause I told y'all I bought like I don't know how many feet they was. 
they was huge. I did the same thing to that one over there until I figure out what I want to do. But I jumped on camera to show you guys that my dirty hair is taking out. Some braids are out. Now I gotta wash it and do something to it. It looks like it's actually kind of short, but I don't think it's as short as it looks. It's just cause it's all matted up to my head. But I just want to say, hey, I got the hair out. So now let's see if I can get the hair done. The part I hate the most. Hey y'all. So all I did was flat iron and curl my hair. Well, I just flat ironed it, like I uh, curled it with flat irons. And it is, it's okay. It doesn't, it never holds. So um, it's gonna do what it's gonna do. Hopefully I can get at least a week and a quarter out of it or more than like that probably only get like two days because my hair never holds a curl it never lasts and um it just never lasts it never holds no matter what i do or how i do it all i'm gonna do is throw a bonnet on it and let it go but for the meantime the hair is gonna do what it's gonna do it's gonna suffice for how it's gonna suffice i'm about to fix my little pup pup some food i'm about to give them some of their Ali food is um the dog food that I told you that they uh that I that we order the um fresh foods so I'm about to warm them up some of that and that is that they acting like they're starving but when I warm up the food they don't eat it it's like my dogs don't got bougie they they don't got too bougie they don't think they got too good to eat they don't food. Like they want to eat our foods. And that's Tiff's fault. That's definitely her fault. But what can we say? We're gonna blame it on her. What I was saying, my hair. Hopefully it'll hold. Hopefully it'll I can get a few days out of it. More than likely, probably by day two, probably even tomorrow, I end up pulling it back in the ponytail because it just never, ever holds. Who are you, handsome? What's your name? What's your name? The name is they hard, nasty. Oh, my child said I got issues. Wait, no, you didn't give me. So, but y'all, I just want to show y'all a little do-rag or my do. It's okay. I don't like wearing my natural hair out because it doesn't hold, doesn't last. And I just don't like how, huh? Yeah, it's short. It ain't long, but it ain't short, short. This time it's your real hair. Yeah, why? You don't like it? Huh? You don't like it? I didn't like it. Oh, I don't care for my real hair. Yeah, I mean, I embrace it, but. I mean, she looks like one of those people from those 1940s. <laughs> <1940s. laughs> but does that look old? No, no, I'm just saying, like, the hairstyle <laughs> itself is like, hey, like. Y'all hear him? He said, I got the, I got a 1950s look going on. What y'all think? Is it 1950s? Or is it just, you know what? To be honest with y'all, we are recycling a lot of hairstyles and styles, period. Fashion from before our time, the 1950s, the 60s, the 70s. It's just natural. You just repeat cycles and repeat the history of the styles. I mean, am I lying? No, no, I'm not. Cause style repeats, JJ. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Like when I was in high school, we would start. We were thinking back 70s, like bell bottom pants and all that stuff. And I see now they're recycling again. Certain pants are bell bottom types. Like the women, like they would, they fit it right here in the legs, and then they flare out at the bottom. So I think the styles is just. What did I want to do? Put that water thing over here. But what y'all think? 1950s or 2022 or 21? I'm already trying to skip 2021. What the hell? So I'm getting ready to go in the room and watch uh, Gone Blaze. I have to watch him because he can jump up on the couch. And if I have candles and stuff lit right here on the, like, the TV stand console thing, he can um, get in them and possibly knock them over or spill wax everywhere. So I don't want him to get burnt by him. So I'll be having to watch his butt. Where you come from? My mom's pussy. I thought she had a C-section. 
I'm just saying. I ain't talking about like that anyways, fool. Oh, I, went, I was going in and give him some water. But I gotta make a Walmart run. Maybe I'll get up early and go to the store before work so I can go get some waters. Cause y'all know we don't drink sink water. Sink water is gross. Lee in here stealing. I ain't water. stealing nothing. You better I'll go. I'll you with a belt. Get out. Who, who are you? I'm Master T. <laughs> You ain't shit. Whatever. Get your ass out. Get your ass out. Shoot. You shoot. Flee. You flee. Paragaraga. You fara ah! So you ain't got no neck. I do got a neck. You do that because you ain't got no neck. I got a neck. You ain't got no neck. I got a neck. Come here, give me some. Don't drink all my juice now. No. no. Tastes good. Yo, you frowning. Tastes good. Yeah, it's nasty. No, actually, it tastes good. I'm surprised. You, why you mix it with the pineapple? You should have tasted it first. I did. Oh. I did, and I done it. And by the way, um, don't. I had to lay it down. Make sure the top on it all the way. You probably can put the food at the second shelf and that on the bottom. By the way, what? By the way, what? I had it. Like it depends on how you mix it. Cause if it's a little more pineapple juice, then it tastes a little more pineapple juice. But if it's a little more mango juice, it combines the flavors. It doesn't taste that bad. So you just made your own tropical juice, that's all. Yes. Let me go in here and fold my clothes. I got some piles of clothes to fold. So I'm about to turn on some tea. I think I'm gonna turn on Lucifer or something else. I'm not sure. And get ready for tomorrow's work day. I gotta find my bonnet. Hopefully one of the dogs can get to it. Cause they always hit my 